Gassed up, ready to get back on this road. I topped off on air to make sure all the tire pressure gauges are in tune and uh, ready to get on the road. I've been trying to be more proactive with my post, uh, putting up um, the Zaddy character as well as. Come on, man, what's happening? Let's do this. These people out here are slow down on the side. saying I want people to give me their input on what they want to see uh, all I've been receiving is you know we don't like this video we don't like what you said about this or what you said about that but you're not telling me what you want to hear now if you're just getting triggered by things that I'm saying that's a you problem you know what I'm saying? You know, I've had all kind of people. I mean, if you can't take a joke, I mean, by this time, the age you are, you should be able to have thick enough skin to take a joke, because I'm sure you out here telling jokes. But it is what it is. I wanted to make some car meets today, but I had to come out do some work on a Saturday it's gloomy it was raining earlier um, try to make it home before I get caught in the rain again but let 
let's just keep it real a lot of people are hurt that you know the Mopar community always finds a way to be on top so you know the electric cars came and kind of took the fastest numbers and this and this and that I really don't even classify that you know because you can't consistently run numbers in an electric car you know without running it to put it on a charger so then the demon 170 came out a lot of people got hurt oh my god these people out here driving like idiots on a saturday like oh my god we done made it through the whole week now it's time to enjoy a little bit and you out here trying to kill somebody this is ridiculous anyway silly but I'm in Westwood right now off the 405 and um, I missed the track these past couple weeks because I've been working longer hours and um, I haven't been able to make it home to hop in the Durango and make it back down the hill to uh to the track you know my road dog uh nicole you know i really like going to the track with her you know it's fun you know it ain't no hating and you know we get friendly runs we talk trash and nobody gets butt hurt and they feelings about the whole situation so it, it makes it fun you have a little competition you know it, it's a fun thing you know we're, we're both learning you know the track I, I mean this year is my first year getting on the track it's my first year actually doing any runs seeing that whole world it's a whole nother world they got some people out there with shit boxes that are defying gravity and velocity. I'm talking about, I've seen dust bo boxes doing low fives. Like, the launching so hard that rust was coming off of that damn shit box. But, you try to line up with that. If you want to. So, I'm not knocking what anyone's driving. I make jokes, I talk trash, and you know, you're supposed to be able to take it on the chin and keep it pushing. Some of y'all out here in my DMs or in the bottom of my timeline talking all reckless, and I'm just like, what is your problem? You just hating because, you know, people is thriving and talking shit and you want your opinion to be heard louder than everybody else? I mean, I tell people right off the bat, if you hop in my comments and you say anything racist, you trying to have arguments in my timeline with somebody else that put a comment, if you ain't got no avatar or picture on your uh, uh name or your account was made like a week ago you ain't got no post stuff like that I'm deleting your comment and I'm blocking you in every account you ever make it's my right because I think you're just here to cause issues you're not here to have a conversation you're just here to start stuff on the internet and nobody's giving you the platform or the place to, to uh, pacify your uh, fuck. That's all I have to say about that. I'm going to leave it right there. If you find yourself not seeing any of my videos or my stuff, you know what happened. 
usually I make my comment right under yours and I make sure that you see it. I give you like three to five minutes and then I block and delete you because I'm petty. That's, that's just how I am. You know, I don't hop on people's DMs or their posts talking trash and, and, and not be able to back it up. If, if you see how many views I have versus likes and how many people view my profile and don't follow or, or comment, it, it's astonishing. Because first, the first instinct is I'm gonna go to his account and see how I can talk trash. And then they get to the account and they're like, oh, okay, wait a minute. Uh, he, he has a Hellcat. As a matter of fact, he has two Hellcats. He had a Scat Pack. He had a 392 Durango SRT. Uh, I've had these cars, so I can talk the trash I'm talking. Okay? I can do that. A lot of people, they up in here with a Honda Civic that ain't even running. And they having arguments about how a dude in a red eye can't beat this. First of all, I don't even entertain you. I, I won't even entertain you. I, I'll just send you uh, somewhere else. You know, somebody else got time for you. I don't. But uh, either way, it's a public service announcement. And uh, you're getting the side view of the cockpit. Hellcat Durango on a Saturday and uh, I just wanted to get out here and talk some shit and uh, hope you guys are having a good weekend and I'm going to try to make it out to a meet this afternoon or this evening and uh, tomorrow see who I can chop it up with uh, if anyone's interested in doing collabs and stuff like that, uh, hit my DM, send me a message, let's do something. But let, let, let's be somebody that's like making content. I don't want to just do a whole bunch of collabs with people that don't do content, you know, because I mean, how we're going to grow if we're not, if I'm doing collabs with somebody that's not doing content. Hit me up. It's your boy Hellboy. Over and out.